All right, hello there, and welcome to this next After Effects tutorial. My name is Kenneth Moore, and today we are going to be talking about parenting and parent layers. So what are parent layers? Basically, you want to think of it as in your After Effects composition, you have one layer that is going to be a child layer and another layer that is going to be the parent layer. So how do we actually do this? Well, if you go over to this column here, you will notice that you have this drop down menu here and if you don't see this column all you have to do is right click on here and then go down to columns and make sure that this parent and link is selected okay good now to make a certain layer a parent layer what we have to do is select the layer that we want to be the child we'll go to that layer select on its drop down menu so we have the star here and we want the square layer to be the parent layer so we'll click on square here and now the square layer is the parent layer to the child layer. Another way that you can do this is you can simply click on this pick whip and you can drag it down and that's another way you can make the square layer a parent layer. Okay, very good. So, let's see what this actually does. If we go down to our rotation here, notice that whatever we do to the square layer the star layer, which is now the child, is going to follow it. That is because the parent layer is the parent and the child is following it. Now, what is this child layer actually following? You will notice this circle here. This is your anchor point. Notice what happens if we move the anchor point. If we select the anchor point tool, you can also select it by pressing Y. If we select the anchor point tool and we put it in the center, notice what happens and if we move the square now notice that the star is now rotating around the anchor point that is because the child layer follows the anchor point of the parent layer so we're gonna put this anchor point back all right very good now let's say we wanted to um, have an animation like this we'll start here and then we will maybe around here we'll drag it up and then before it gets to the top here say we wanted this star to do something completely different how could we do this well we could go to our star layer up here and we can press Control shift D or command shift D if you're on a Mac and we can split the layer in half and on this new layer we can have it set to none so that it will not be affected by the square layer it has no parent now and we can give this a completely different animation so we'll put the position to here and then we'll have it go completely off to the other side like that all right very good so what does this look like yep perfect so the star layer follows the parent layer and then it breaks off and then it goes out and does something completely different. So that is basically the concept of parenting. I hope you learned something in this video. If you like this video and want to receive more content like this, be sure to subscribe below and we will see you on the next one. Until next time.